we're at Oz Trucking TVs out here talking with Power Hansen. Uh, it's been two years since we spoke to you last, one. Yeah, it's been a while. It's been a while. Um, uh, but you have to wait for the good things. Yes. Um, now, just uh, what we got on the on the Volvo stand here at the Brisbane Truck Show is um, uh, we have four trucks. Uh, we got an uh, FM 500 Global Trotter. Uh, in front of that, we have a uh, FH 700 uh, 700 horsepower. Uh, that is uh, this particular truck is sold to a customer in WA. Uh, he'll pick it up on Sunday. Over on the right there, we have the bread and butter truck, really for um, for uh, um, uh, B double work. That is the FH600, um, and behind that we have the FMX, which we are not quite sure if will be introduced into the Australian market. We are just waiting to gauge, you know, what what the people's reaction are. Then of course we got all the inter interactive displays, you know, like cost of trucks and and Dyna Fleet Volvo's telematic system. Um, we have also as what we are sitting in here with the, the the FMX rollover, uh, where we are trying to demonstrate the importance of wearing a, a seatbelt. Um, and uh, maybe one f good little feature we have here on the on the on the on the Volvo is uh, the alchometer, you know. Um, which is very used in, in Europe now. You blow in it, and if you're over the limit, uh, the truck won't start. Oh, great. Yep. So uh, uh, we're not quite we've st we're not quite sure if it will be introduced into Australia because we do have some issues with um, with um, uh, some of some states have zero tolerance, and they cannot do this here zero, zero tolerance. It, it needs to be zero point uh, two. So, so that is uh, yet to be seen. But a lot of uh, a lot of companies in Europe they actually install them now uh, in their trucks uh, um, as a sort of a safety thing, I suppose, um, and make sure that their drivers not are uh, driving under the influence. And it can certainly also be helpful for the drivers, you know, to know that uh, they actually get a, a warning if they've been out the night before and 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 um, and. Uh, Really, you shouldn't drive now, and I think we all we all will be in that position. We'd rather get a warning than have a policeman give us a warning. Well, you'd rather know than get absolutely. pulled over. Yeah, absolutely. Exactly. Yeah. So, but but if really, in the end, if in the end of the day, you know, uh, uh, with the alcohol lock, it's not really not. Uh, it's not about saving your license and whatnot. It's about not having an accident. Yes. So that that is what it's all about. Yeah. Uh, okay. So now with the rollover simulator here, uh, that this this here demonstrates the importance of wearing a seatbelt. Now, if if uh, we get this here up to about 40 or 50 degrees, we are still able to um, uh, get out of that rollover if we, if we uh, steer into the rollover. So here now I have to steer to the left and yep. I'll get out of that roll. Of course, if I steer to the right, you know, it'll just go it'll flat just on its side. Out, yeah. So I can do that uh, probably all, uh, uh, up to here. I can still get out of the rollover if, if I have enough space um, uh, to, to make that maneuver. Of course, I can't do that if I'm not sitting in the driver's seat. You yeah. know, if I don't have a seat belt on, I will not be sitting in the driver's seat. So now uh, I'm, 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 I'm strapped into I'm strapped into the seat, and I can still accelerate and brake, and I can turn radio on and blow in my alcohol or whatever. You know, I can still do all that sort of stuff. Um, but uh, if if I didn't have my seat belt on, I would be over where you're sitting now, in a very uh, compromising position. I'll say. Um, um, uh, and of course, you know, this here is in conjunction with uh, probably, uh, uh, not probably, but the safest cap on the market with, uh, with the airbag and seatbelt pretensioner and, and the safety, cap, safety capsule we actually are sitting in here. Uh, if, God forbid, it, that we were to roll over a truck, if you wear your seatbelt and, uh, and you are in a safety capsule, capsule like we are here, there is a very, very good chance that we will we'll walk away. But all, all this sort of safety gear don't help if you don't wear the seatbelt. I am Pierre Hansen uh, from Volvo Trucks. Uh, I'm Volvo Trucks uh, um, National Product Trainer and you are watching Us Trucking TV.
Okay, everybody, we're here with Jeff from Cat Trucks. And uh, hey, Jeff, how are you? Yeah, good, Nick, and yourself? Not too bad. Thanks for having us here, mate. No um, tell us a bit about uh, yourself and what you got on display here. Yeah, well, we've got this is this is Cat Trucks' first Brisbane truck show. So we we launched our products back in late November 2010. So only six months ago now. So feels like just yesterday, but. Um, We've launched, we've got two base models, the CT610 and the CT630. The CT610 is fitted with our 13 litre engine, the CAT Assert C13 engine, and then the 630 is fitted with the C15 engine. So we've got a 470 horsepower 13 litre and we've got a 550 horsepower 15 litre. Both conventional trucks, um, most, most aerodynamic cab configuration in its class. And um, our initial trucks that we're, we're starting to get on the road now, the, the feedback with fuel economy has been fantastic. And we're starting to actually get the feedback of some of the claims that we're making that, that our fuel economy is going to be better than others because of, because of the aerodynamics of our truck. Uh, we're sitting here today in the, the, the CAT CT610, which has got the, the, the C13 engine. We had an 18 speed Eaton Road Ranger. I think most, most of your, your drivers out there would be familiar with the the 18 speed box there and nice and easy to drive. Uh, we've, we've got a nice vision out, out of our windscreen. You probably can't tell from the, um, the video footage there but um, the windscreen's actually got a nice rearward slope on it which helps with the, the fuel economy. Also helps with the, the wind noise inside the cabin. So when you're driving down the road you've, you've, you've got a nice quiet comfortable cabin with with very very low wind resistance, so the the air flows around the cabin quite nice. So you you get a nice quiet cab with with not too much wind noise. And you match that with the the Caterpillar engine, the Eaton box. We've got Meritor axles on Hendrickson suspensions. You know the, the drive line that that everybody out there knows and trusts. And um, we get a good package. And um, being the Brisbane Truck Show, we're actually getting lots of people wanting to come and sit in our trucks, which is fantastic. So you, you can probably see the, the yellow truck over here, which is our CT630 extended cabin, which, which that truck there fits will fit a um, 34 pallet drop deck B double on the back of it and still be compliant within 26 metres. So we've got the front underrun protection, we've got the cab safety and the six and a half tonne front axle so we can we can get the compliance within the 26 metres. We, we, obviously our trucks fit into many different configurations, a tipper and dogs, and prime movers, B doubles, low loaders and um, yeah, a lot of different configurations, metro, intrastate and interstate type work. So yeah, we've only got two base models, but we've got a, a, a good variety of, of applications we fit in. The trucks are all being sold through the Caterpillar dealer network around the country. So we've got about 50 locations around Australia now, um, with, with the sales currently based in the capital cities. So if you're interested in buying a cat truck, you can, you can go to cat truck cattrucks.com.au and um, that'll steer you in the direction of one of our dealers or you can go to William Adams in Victoria, West Track in New South Wales or Western Australia, Hastings Deering in Queensland and Northern Territory and Cav Power in South Australia. So good, we've got a good dealer network around the country that's that's got a really good product support base and out there to support the whole of truck bumper to bumper. So the cat dealers don't only support the truck and the engine, they'll support the whole truck bump, bumper to bumper. So gearbox, axles and suspensions and the like as well. So we've got a good package out there today. Yeah, we're only the new kids on the block, as, as they say. But um, we're, we're out there now and um, we'd love to talk to you. So if you guys out there are interested in talking to us, please come and see us. Visit us at cattrucks.com.au and we'll see what we can do to help you out. Thanks very much.